Hello welcome to Objective Question Answer MCQ's YouTube channel. With a positive vibes let's start this video. Question number 1. Wild buffalo is an endangered species because Option A its population is diminishing. Option B it has become extinct. Option C it is found exclusively in a particular area. Option D its poaching is strictly prohibited. The right answer is option A. Species of plants or animals diminishing to a level at which they may get extinct are known as endangered species. Population of wild buffalo too is diminishing tremendously. Question number 2. Which one of the following changes may occur due to desertification? Option A decrease in atmospheric temperature. Option B increase in water holding capacity of soil. Option C increased chances of floods. Option D conversion of fertile land into a desert. The right answer is option D. Deforestation alters the soil properties leading to soil erosion. Due to soil erosion the lower, rocky surface gets exposed possessing less humus. In this way, the fertile land gets converted into deserts. This is known as desertification. Question number 3. Which one of the following statements is true about a biosphere reserve? Option A. It is a protected area where only endemic species live. Option B. It is meant only for the conservation of plants and animals. Option C. It is meant to conserve both, the biodiversity and the culture of that area. Option D. There are no other protected areas within its limits. The right answer is option C. Biosphere reserve refers to the areas intended to conserve both the biodiversity and the culture of those enclosed areas. Question number 4. The place meant for conservation of biodiversity in their natural habitat are Number 1. Zoological Garden Number 2. Wildlife Sanctuary Number 3. Botanical Garden Number 4. National Park Option A1 and 2 Option B2 and 3 Option C3 and 4 Option D1 and 4 The right answer is option C. Wildlife sanctuaries are meant for the conservation and protection of wild animals by facilitating them with suitable living conditions. Poaching or capturing of animals is prohibited in wildlife sanctuaries. Some of the threatened wild animals are protected and preserved in wildlife sanctuaries. On the other hand national parks are large and diverse areas meant to the protect the entire ecosystem including the flora, fauna, landscape and the historical objects of that area. Question number 5. 
Which one of the following statements is true about endemic species? Option A. They are found exclusively in a specific habitat. Option B. Camphor endemic species can never become endangered. Option C. They are found only in zoos and botanical gardens. Option D. They are not affected by the destruction of their habitat. The right answer is option A. Endemic species refers to the species of plants and animals found in a particular area. A specific type of animals or plant can be endemic to a zone, a state or a country. Question number 6. Which of the following feature is correct for a wildlife sanctuary? Option A. It is an artificially created protected area for animals. Option B. It is a protected area for threatened and endangered wild animals. Option C. It is meant for conservation of only plant species. Option D. Capturing and poaching of animals is strictly prohibited here. The right answer is option A. Capturing and poaching of animals is strictly prohibited here. A wildlife sanctuary is an area specially designated where it is illegal to interfere in any way with the natural life there. Hunting, shooting and fishing would be prohibited. Question number 7. Which statement is incorrect about endangered species? Option A. Their number has decreased drastically. Option B. They might become extinct in the near future. Option C. They pose a danger to other animals. Option D. Their natural habitat needs to be protected. The right answer is option C. They pose a danger to other animals. An endangered species is a species which has been categorized as likely to become extinct hence they can never pose a danger to other animals. Question number 8. What do black buck, elephant, python and golden cat together represent in a forest option a fauna option b flora option c ecosystem option d species the right answer is option a they all together represent the fauna of the forest Question number 9. The Red Data Book keeps a record of all the Number 1. Endemic Species Number 2. Extinct Species Number 3. Endangered Plants Number 4. Endangered Animals Option A1 and 2. Option B2 and 3. Option C3 and 4. Option D1 and 4. The right answer is option C. Red Data Book is a book keeping the records of all the endangered animals and plants.
Question number 10. Migratory birds fly to far away areas during a particular time of a year. Which of the following conditions present in their habitat during that time are responsible for this behavior? Number 1. Unavailability of food. Number 2. Extreme weather conditions. Number 3. Overcrowding. Number 4. Lack of nesting areas. Option A2 and 3. Option B1 and 2. Option C1 and 4. Option D2 and 4. The right answer is option B. Migratory birds fly to far away areas during a particular time of a year due to unavailability of food and extreme weather conditions. Question number 11. In our country, large patches of forests are being cleared for cultivation of crops. The environmental impact of such a practice will lead to Option A Soil Erosion Option B Soil Conservation Option C Soil Pollution Option D Soil Fertility The right answer is Option A. Trees anchors the soil with their roots. But loss of these trees cause widespread erosion throughout the tropics. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel Objective Question Answer MCQs. And always remember, never stops learning because life never stops teaching.